Atonement, the vanilla megawatt by the Mysterious Moustachio. I've played through maps 1 through 11, and that completes E1 and E2. So as we wait for the rest of the maps to come out, though, um, there's a couple bonus maps. Maps 18 and I believe 21 are also complete, so he released those with the release of 1 through 11. So we'll go ahead and play 18. <laughs> Not a lot of time for commentary here. So, this is a uh, S on Hectic Castle. Um, 297 kills. Wow, 60 items, five secrets. Uh, really like this opener here. Very hectic. Uh, nice design here. We've got a castle building thing here, obviously. Some damaging floor, some rock texture, and here's my way in. Not sure I want to go in there. <laughs> That's dangerous. Again, the combat stays very dynamic, to say the least. You come in here, 
you kind of are rushing in as you fall off of there and boom we got guys here chain gunners open up and guys over there I like that there's a medikit down there so that I know I can get back up should I fall down oh and there's rockets Ooh, that's tempting yeah what we're going for it. <laughs> So there's a switch over here. Plenty of health here, so that's cool. I'm, I am only on Hurt Me Plenty, that's what I've played all these on. Let's grab those. Alright, so. Yeah, that was, that was interesting, because once you, you feel like you got a moment to chill and relax, and then you cross the bridge, and boom, more monsters coming. Not a problem, I'll just come back and shoot rockets. Oh, nope, cacodemons are coming through, so. I like how they come through the windows. That's a nicely designed uh, encounter there. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and save here. It's a megasphere. Ooh, chain gun. I don't even have one yet, do I? Alright. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, there's plenty of health though, so there's some more. Grab those with the backpack. And those, thank you. Yeah, really good combat so far. You know, you come into a trap and you think, uh oh, maybe if I run back, nope, we got demons and revenants there. Maybe if I blaze through, nope, we got ourselves plenty of monsters in here. Yeah, he's basically just not letting me run and hide, which is cool. Oh no, there's an Archie over there.
Oh crap, I still got him. Oh come on. Alright, that was like super cheap. But it was kind of safe. Uh, yeah, this is a really cool castle so far. A lot of different ways to go. A lot of monsters in different places. It certainly does feel like... Um, you know, it kind of feels like an upgrade of... What is it? The Citadel? Like a better version of it. Which also might be map 18, I can't remember. There's a suit, do I need that? What's this? Oh. Oh. Okay, so that's probably damaging. Oh jeez. Uh oh. Alright, sounds like it's gonna hit the fan. Megasphere, it's definitely gonna hit the fan. Oh, there's another arch pile somewhere. Him. Good. More rockets. Love rockets. Oh, cat demons. Where are they? What's up here? Oh, this is just the alternate way down, I guess. We'll grab another suit. I guess I gotta get the mega screen and hit the switch. It's very interesting how there's. It's actually fairly linear. Um, but it does not feel or play that way at all. But there really are not uh, decisions to make. As far as which way to go, you pretty much go the way you have to go. There's nowhere to go. I don't. I'm not sure what the switch did. Can't get up there. I can't. Um. Oh. Look. Okay. That was down before. Raise it up. So I can go back in here now. Cool. But there's another arch file somewhere. That's not cool. Yeah, that's really cool. I like that a lot. Raising up the bridge. Um, it's probably... It's probably difficult to do a castle well with vanilla. Um, but so far, so good. You know, it's just pretty much the brown and the gray brick. Uh, but here it works. It certainly works. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Yeah. Gotta find me some secrets. So I go this way. What are we at? 167. Uh oh. oh crap. He is raising everybody. Oh, Red Skull key. I didn't even know that was up there. How am I gonna do this? I'm gonna end up eating a rocket for sure. I was going to say, there should be plenty of shells over there. Alright. Yeah, I really screwed myself by eating a rock again. Alright, red key. I don't remember red door. Red door. Red door. Red door. I got them all. Man, I suck. I suck. Alright. Is that BFG? Oh my goodness, I need these secrets. Where do I get these? I need to get in there. Come on. Oh. How did I miss that? Oh, I see.
this exit. Well, that's no fun. We got to kill everybody, don't we? Save it just in case I. Wasn't sure if I could get over that or not. That's it. Oh, there's tons more monsters, though. Huh. Seems like that shouldn't be the exit. <laughs> huh. There's like 40 more monsters. Maybe that's not really the exit. We'll see. That's the exit. All right. Strike on Hectic Castle. Indeed. Hectic Castle. Um, yeah, so let's just put it this way. This dude can map. I thought that was outstanding. Um... Just the way that the castle was laid out was really well done. It uh, it really was rather straightforward as far as where you went, but it certainly did not feel that way at all. Just the way that the design was, a lot of nice uh, height variations. You were up, you were down in the motor slime or whatever damaging floor. You were in towers, you were going under arches and stuff, you were raising up bridges, it was just really excellent, the gameplay, and, and the switches were always very clear, you could pretty much always watch it happen. Um, just the one key there, that's all you needed though, it was uh, decently long, but, but hectic indeed, just uh, throughout the whole map there's always monsters in your face, I didn't really get a lot of opportunity to comment uh, on like the visual things. But, uh, yeah, it wasn't overly detailed, obviously, a lot of the gray and the brown big brick. Um, but I think it worked fine, it was, it looked good enough, it, it looked great for, uh, vanilla for a castle. Um, yeah, just, just well done design, especially, and, and the combat here was, was great. It was never, like, all that hard or unfair at all. Um, I'm playing on Hurt Me Plenty, and, what, I died one or, once or twice, I think. Um, yeah, there's always plenty of mon- you always gotta move, you always have to react, but it's not like you have nowhere to go. You always have somewhere to go, you just gotta go there, you just gotta, gotta make sure you have your wits about you a little bit so that you don't get yourself killed, so. Combat, excellent. Uh, design, excellent. Visuals, pretty good. That's, uh, map 18 of Atonement presumably part of the upcoming release of the next several maps.